So when you're visiting London, there is a lot of options that you can go around from place to place. So in today's video, I will show you the best options uh, to explore and move around the city. So the first thing you need to do is to download the City Mapper app, which is the easiest way to figure out on how to move around London. So City Mapper app is very easy to use and basically you just need to add the starting point of your journey and then end point and it will give you a lot of options how to get there so it will give you option to go by a walk take a tube or bus so first option uh, to get around london is by renting a body's bike so it's the London cycling system, officially called Santander Bikes. Uh, why is called the Boris Bike? It's very popular in London to call it Boris Bike because it's been launched by Boris Johnson previously when he was the mayor of London. So um, it's very good to go around in this kind of cheap way um, to explore central London when the weather is good. But of course, you need to be very careful on the roads. There's a lot of um, rental stations to get your bike around the city. Uh, you just need to enter the details on the computer screen. You need a debit or credit card and then uh, they will issue a ticket. So you take the printed ticket, release ticket, and you take your bike. So the option number two is the bus. You can take the bus. I think it's the coolest thing that you can do is um, go on the upper deck and take the first two front seats and you can enjoy London view just for £1.50. So very important thing to remember is that in London you cannot pay for the transport in cash. You need to have uh, your contactless debit or credit card or you need to buy an Oyster card. So when you're entering the bus you have to touch your Oyster card or contactless card and it costs uh, £1.55. Uh, you can take unlimited buses for free within one hour of touching in your first journey. And the third option is London Underground. So London Underground is a very good system to move around London fast. So what you're gonna need to have is your Oyster card or contactless debit uh, or credit card. And when you enter in the station, you tap in. And when you exit the station, you tap out. Uh, London is divided into the zones, zone one to zone six. And the cost of the journey is depends between what zones you're traveling. But on City Mapper app, you can see all the prices of your journey. So today I cover the three most important transport links that you can use when you're visiting London. Please comment below if you have any questions and I would be happy to answer them all. Don't forget to like and subscribe for our channel for more tips about London and more tips and tricks to prepare for your journey when you're visiting England for first time.